Hi, I'm Bob Hasegawa, your state senator for the 11th Legislative District, here with our first legislative update for this 2016 legislative session that just started. So um, I have fairly low expectations of what to expect as an outcome uh, because this is not a primary budget writing year. This is just our short session. It'll last 60 days and we're just supposed to be doing uh, policy issues mainly and possible tweaks to our budget if they were needed from uh, last year. So it looks like um, tweaks will be very minor. We have very limited capacity here because uh, of our debt capacity limit that we're reaching. We only have about $80 million available uh, in our capital budget. Transportation was pretty much settled last year, so as far as operating goes, you know that we have our big issue, which is trying to fund basic education and adhere to the Supreme Court's uh, McCleary decision. Uh, we're at a fundamental standoff, though, really, this legislative session is because we have a divided gov government. We have uh, the Democrats who control the House by a slim one-vote margin, and uh, the Republicans control the Senate with a slim three-vote margin. So uh, until we as a state philosophically come together and say we want to follow one path or the other, we're going to continue with divided government. And I know that people want to blame the legislature for gridlock. But the truth of the matter is the legislature actually does reflect where the people are at. So we as a people are going to have to decide what is the uh, dream or the vision that we have for our own state. Until we figure that out, unfortunately, um, I'm sad to say I don't have a high expectation for us as a legislature reflecting that division within our state to get very far. Uh, that being said, um, we do have other policy issues uh, which I'm hoping to be able to move this session. Uh, you know that uh, race is a growing issue in our state and we just uh, recognized Martin Luther King Jr.'s birthday. Uh, if you want to see that floor speech that I made on that from our legislative session uh, yesterday on January 18th, uh, you can go to TVW and uh, see that. I had a hearing on a bill this morning to try and create an industrial hemp industry within the state of Washington. That's one that has huge potential for creating a half billion dollar new industry for the growers of our state. Uh, it's exciting and I hope that that one moves. We had a good hearing on it and the chair of the Agriculture Committee does support it, so hoping that bill moves. I'm having a hearing on another bill this, later this afternoon to rename the uh, State Highway 99, uh, which is technically titled the Jefferson Davis Memorial Highway. I'm trying to rename that one uh, for obvious reasons. Uh, I have uh, many bills sitting in rules, so we're having a rules meeting committee uh, today and tomorrow to try and build our floor calendar package. So I'm hoping to get several of my bills out of rules onto the Senate floor for votes so we can get them over to the House and to the governor's desk uh, for signature. So that's where we're at right now. I can't go too long. Uh, I'm very limited in my time here, but if you do want to contact me with any pressing issues, uh, please don't hesitate to call my office or contact me through email. Uh, my information, contact info, will be scrolling across the bottom of the screen. So, wish us luck this legislative session, and I will talk to you very shortly. Again, I'm Bob Hasegawa, your state senator for the 11th Legislative District.